Hi my Libras, it's Jamie Zebra 23. I am doing your weekly spread for Libra Sun, Moon, and Rising. I'm on all social media, it's Jamie Zebra 23. If you'd like a personal reading, check out my website, jamiezebra23.com. Um, my readings are $25, $50, and $75. No throwing. I've got a new feature, um, same day readings. It's a little pricier, but you do get your reading the same day. I also have a $5 one question, one answer via email only. Um, I've got kits for love, money, and protection, spells for love, money, and protection. Um, I've got all sorts of stuff on my website. Um, I've got sage, I've got charcoal, I've got pendulums, I've got spices for sale, I've got um, ingredients to do pretty much whatever you need to do. All sorts of good stuff. Check it out. Um, I've got two pages to my website, so you got to scroll down to the bottom, and then it'll give you the option to get to the second page. So do that. All right, this is what we got going on. The Emperor, the Death card, the Judgment card, the Seven of Wands, and then the Page of Cups. So there's definitely a water sign, a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio from the past that's going to be contacting you. Um, for those of you that were looking for jobs, expect the end of the week for, uh, for, for you to get a call back about a job. Um, it's looking good. Also, <coughs> for those of you that are attempting to get back together with a water sign, a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio, it's saying it's a go. This person does want to get back together with you too. Also, many of you will be getting back together with an ex this week. For sure, for sure. Others of you with an Aries, you guys will be breaking up with the Aries. There will no longer be an Aries in your life. You're done. Or Aries is no longer... Um, or an Aries doesn't want you in their life anymore, Libra. <coughs> With this card here, it's saying that you really need to watch what you're doing. Watch your thoughts. Watch your actions. Watch. You know, really, really consider every everything before you do it. Um, I feel like uh, for some of you, you've been up to no good. Um, you know, a lot of people are, are hitting, like finishing up their karmic cycles. And, <coughs> excuse me. In my other reading, I swallowed a, um, a mosquito. How cute. Yeah. That was funny to see on camera. Um, yeah. Uh, so some of you, um, are ending it with an Aries or there's an Aries that's going to end it with you. They don't want, they don't want to reconcile. They don't want the drama. They don't want the chaos. If you're cross watching for a Libra, they might not want you back Aries. And then for others of you, things have been really uh, smooth sailing and calm for you lately. Um, there may be a bit of a shakeup with that. Um, things might get a little rocky this week towards the beginning of the week, but by the end of the week, things will, things will cool down. Also, a lot of you are attempting to get second jobs or juggle a lot of different things at once. It's saying that you need to delegate. You can't do it all by yourself. You really need to get some help. Like, um, you know, you can't, you can't have seven jobs and seven kids. And then, you know, you want to like go to every, um, basketball game, every sports event, you're biting off more than you can chew. See, he, he can't, he's holding what he can. He wants to go back and collect those other ones, but he can't, it's too much. It's a burden. And then others of you, um, you just, I feel like for others of you, you just don't want to get back together with your ex. You don't want anything to do with your ex. You don't even know why your ex would even be contacting you. You're like, doesn't this person already know that this is never, ever going to happen? It's just not a possibility. This person doesn't know that, Libra. This person thinks that they can do whatever they want. They're a narcissist. They're crazy. They're sick. No. Also, you got a, um, you got a, a fellow air sign, a Gemini, Libra, or an Aquarius that's attempting to contact a water sign behind your back, a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio. For some of you, you've got exes that are trying to contact, or I mean, you've got currents current boyfriend or girlfriend that's trying to contact an ex from the past or they are talking to an ex from the past and they're not saying anything also um for a lot of you um somebody's coming in this week i feel like at first you're not going to know what to make of it at the beginning of the week you're going to be like is this person for real hmm there's no way that one's interested in me What's really going on? This person's going to come off really hot and heavy. This person's going to come off really clingy, really obsessive. This could be any zodiac sign. And then when you do not reciprocate or when you give them the feeling like you don't want to be with them or a feeling like they can't trust you, like you've got secrets or you're hiding something or you're playing head games, they're going to run away. They're going to be gone. Poof. 
So really watch watch how, how you respond to someone. So if somebody's coming to you with an open heart and open arms and you shoot them down, especially if it's a water sign or a um or a Sagittarius, they'll just run away. All right guys, ta-ta for now.